JetBlue launches first ever Miami flights. JetBlue celebrates 21st birthday with new flight JetBlue's Miami launch includes service to four U.S. cities JetBlue serves nearly 100 domestic and international blue cities now also including the Magic City. Miami International Airport and JetBlue had two major milestones to celebrate yesterday the low-cost carrier's launch of first-ever flights at the airport, as well as the airline's 21 SD birthday. Miami-Dade County and JetBlue officials hosted a ribbon-cutting ceremony at MIA that included a water cannon salute and special gifts to first-time passengers. Attendees included, Miami-Dade County Mayor Daniela Levine Cava, Board of County Commissioners Chairman Jose Pepe Diaz, Lester Sola, MIA Director and CEO, David Clark, JetBlue Vice President of Sales and Revenue Management, and Bill Talbert, President and CEO. Greater Miami Convention and Visitors Bureau. JetBlue's historic launch into Miami-Dade County is great news for our families, tourism industry, and business community, as we work to help our economy rebound from the pandemic, said Miami-Dade County Mayor Daniela Levine Cava. I proudly welcome JetBlue to Miami-Dade. And I'm pleased to see them taking important steps to keep passengers and employees safe and healthy. JetBlue's Miami launch includes service to four U.S. cities, Boston up to four times daily, Los Angeles up to twice daily, New York JFK up to four times daily, and Newark up to four times daily. The 14 daily flights will make JetBlue one of MIA's busiest passenger airlines. The Miami-Los Angeles route will feature JetBlue Mint, the airline's premium travel experience. MIA estimates that JetBlue's new service will generate 1.4 million passengers, nearly $1.915 million in business revenue and 7,300 jobs into the local economy annually. Welcoming JetBlue, one of the world's leading low-cost carriers and busiest airlines overall, to our network is truly a landmark event in our airport's history, and we thank them for making this substantial commitment to MIA and Miami-Dade County, said Lester Sola, MIA Director and CEO. Today also would not be possible without the ongoing support of Mayor Levine Cava, our Board of County Commissioners, and the Greater Miami Convention and Visitors Bureau. We look forward to receiving JetBlue's 14 daily flights and the sizable economic impact that they bring to our community. Headquartered in New York and trademarked as New York's hometown airline, JetBlue serves nearly 100 domestic and international blue cities now also including the Magic City. Florida has always played a key role in JetBlue's success story and that continues today on our 21 St. anniversary as we introduce our low fares and award-winning service to Miami, said Andrea Lusso, Vice President Network Planning, JetBlue. With our newest destination we can offer customers more choices, diversify our flying and enhance JetBlue's broader presence in South Florida.